Welcome to Fat Free Taster, food reviews without the fat. Today in the show we're going to be doing a second Nestle review um, in their series of diet products. Um, we have today the Soleil Diet Creme Caramel. So this is a, a low fat version of the French treat. Um, if we have a look at our nutritional facts here, we'll say there's one gram of fat per serve and about 76 calories. So in terms of, uh, of, of watching those, um, that fat count and that calorie count, um, very low. Um, if we pop her open here. We can see that uh, it's got that uh, yellow sort of goldy custody color um, and the, the caramel sauce, um, which is um, part, of the, part of the dessert, um, is sitting at the bottom there. Um, looks okay. Now for the all important part, let's have a taste. So first of all, the consistency of the, of the custard um, is not too bad. Um, you know, relatively um, medium density, uh, a little thick, not too lumpy. Yeah, the, the, the custard tastes good. Um, it's quite sweet, it has that vanilla taste. Um, I'm not sure they've, uh, they've actually captured uh, the, the, the creaminess um, as well as they've done in other products like the chocolate mousse, uh, but nonetheless tastes okay. We'll now get down to the bottom here and, uh, and have a taste of the caramel sauce, see what that does. Yeah, the caramel sauce is a nice addition. Um, I would say you don't get any of that kind of burnt caramel taste that you would get in the traditional dessert. Um, but if we have a look here, what they're like, sort of mixed up together a little bit, have another crack at it. Yeah, I would say overall a good dessert. Um, it's a very low fat product and very low in calories, so um, you do compromise a little bit on taste. Um, you're certainly not getting the same product you would if you went full fat, uh, but certainly a tasty dessert. And, and considering the nutritional facts, I think they've done a good job. Uh, not quite as good as the um, as the chocolate mousse, which we reviewed in previous episode, but uh, but I would say this is um, a, a good strong six and a half out of ten. Thanks for watching, guys.